Alright guys, welcome to Lothful. Basically, I guess you're pretty much in this, you know, horror game or whatever. Dude, I'm not talk I, I, I lost my train of thought, but... <laughs> but basically in this game, you're like an employee at this company who, who, who makes like virtual reality, you know, type of stuff. You know, goggles, yeah, goggles or whatever. I can't, I, dude, I can't think today, god damn it. But, you know, you make goggles and stuff like that, and, uh, you know, you're trying to make this product or whatever vacation you know in VR and stuff like that but I don't know something's going on or something like that but here we go I guess so we got a pretty unique loading screen here it's got like we have like a I don't know, desktop computer but you guys can see some of it all right here we go today marks your first day at Neuronet Solutions a pioneering company at the forefront of technological innovation specializing in cutting-edge technologies they have recently announced the development of a groundbreaking virtual reality experience set to redefine leisure and entertainment Envisioned immersive vacations uh, from the comfort of your home. Every sensation feels real and every adventure awaits. Wait, how'd that feel though? You're just sitting in your chair like, dang bro, the beach or whatever, I don't know. As you step onto your office today, you're stepping into the future. This is your first day, you have the opportunity to try to demo the virtual experience in advance, allowing to frame yourself with the technology you'll be working with in the future. Thank you for joining Neural Network Solutions and let the adventure begin. Alright, here we go. Alright, starting off pretty good here. Got some cinematics, you know. Oh, did it put you in a pod, bro? Oh, I see. I, see. I, I, I thought it was like with goggles and stuff. <laughs> you guys are hearing that one theory, though? It's like we're just living in a simulation or something. Or maybe aliens are living in a simulation, you know? They're all like, man, the universe sucks, you know, or whatever. And so they, they like live in pods or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it, but I heard I heard about it like I don't know how long ago. It's like I I think the, like the one thing about that theory though is like um, uh, what's it called um, it's like these aliens. It's, it's like it's like the reason we haven't seen any aliens, you know, despite you know how long we've been around or whatever, is because they're all living in v in VR, bro. Or I <laughs> I don't know. Uh, hello, recruit. Welcome to New York Solutions Virtual World. Before I get you stayed in your assignments, here's a short tutorial you can do inside the virtual simulation. Press E, okay, yep. Standard stuff. That was a bit too slow for me, to be honest. Pick up, I just like this key, uh-huh. Okay? This, this still sounds quiet, quiet though, I don't know. Maybe this is a quiet game, I have no idea. And then basically just do the simple stuff. Alright guys. Game's teaching us to do basic things here. Oh yeah, I mean, if an audience in here, someone's a bit like I don't know, cut in half over here or something, dude. What am I doing in here? Hello? Oh yeah, the key in your boss hand side the ride vehicle. Oh, proceed, bound to press E default. This is a ride vehicle. Oh, you just click on a chair. I still know like no way to go around though. Now why are you doing like some kind of Half Life intro here, dude? <laughs> If you guys ever played Half-Life, you know, the back in the day or whatever, you're on like the monorail thing. I think that one was like Welcome a lot faster to than To the heart of Neural Net Solutions. Within these walls of innovation and possibility, you found not just a workplace, but a gateway to boundless opportunity. Mm -hmm. Your presence here is more than a mere step. It's a leap into a future where dreams meet reality. All right. We extend our heartfelt thanks for choosing to embark on this extraordinary journey alongside us. Your inaugural day at Neural Net Solutions will be dedicated to immersing yourself within the tapestry of experiences we create. Today, allow us to unveil a glimpse of what awaits you within our spectacular virtual vacation resort. Hmm. Step inside one of our virtual reality modules and discover a new world where you can explore, indulge, and savor these introductory adventures. Yep, already done that. Dude, what happens if I have to use the bathroom, though? It's like, well, if you spend like the entire day, bro, it's like, how are you gonna take a, a dookie or something, dude? I don't know. <laughs> these carefully designed moments offer a taste of the canvas that you'll help paint in the days ahead. And remember, should you encounter anything noteworthy or wish to share your insights, our dedicated staff is always at your service. Alright. 
What if you get hungry, though? None yeah. of this breathtaking journey would have been possible without our dedicated team's relentless pursuit of excellence. And at the pinnacle of our innovation stands uh. M Man, our groundbreaking, award winning artificial intelligence. I just this state of the art intelligence meticulously can fucking shake your experience with mm. the simulation. Everything you encounter today will have been made by him specifically for you. Ah, uh, the AI, yeah. That's weird, bro, not gonna lie, dude. It's like, yeah, to stick a tube up your booty or something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh. Or if you're like some utter degenerate, dude. You're just like spending, you spend like your entire waking hour in this VR thing. How would you even survive? I have no idea. Like, what if you, like I said, what if you get hungry, dude? Hey, what? Deaths? Disappearance is debunked. Any allegations about disappearances, deaths, or unsettling occurrences within neural net solutions have remained unproven to this day. Mere rumor, unfounded, and unsubstantiated. But worry not. While mm -hmm. M Man may be in control of your experience, we have added extra security measure to make sure that no harm can come to you while inside the simulation. All right. So someone can't, you know, say this is in London. Step right? forth oh. into the realm of infinite possibilities. Whether scaling majestic peaks or diving into uncharted realms, mm -hmm. your journey through Neural Net Solutions virtual vacations begins here. Embrace the future, where every adventure is yours to explore. All right. So let's say you're in London, right? Someone breaks open your pot and like sh shanks you. It's like, <laughs> it's like what was saying, stop it or something. I have no idea. All right, guys, I think we're done. I still have to work. All right. You know, yep. You had to go all out on that. You couldn't just do like a in a room with a projector or something. But here we go, guys. Oh, it's so dark though, dude. Why is, if this is like VR and stuff like that, why is there no one walking around? Why is everything just like cardboard, dude? We thought this was a good idea. I have no idea. Alright, here we go. Yeah, who thought this was a good idea? It was like, where's the people walking around, bro? I thought, yeah, I want to make this fun or something, dude. What is this? Welcome to our virtual vacation resort. As a member of the testing team, you have an extraordinary opportunity to shape this experience. Expertise and observations are crucial for perfecting the virtual paradise. Please document any glitches or suggestions before during your expeditions, and uh, we thank you for being part of this ex exciting endeavor. Enjoy forgettable, unforgettable ex adventures with our virtual resort. PS is attached as a key to elevator. Then pick it up reading this. Okay, so we got a key now. All right, pretty cool. <clears throat> Man, I gotta drink some water, bro. That's one thing though about this game. <clears throat> Is that this, um, it's like super quiet, bro. You, you guys are, just, just listen, it's just, it's just, it's just quiet in here. Oh, that's how we save. Yeah, it's just eerily quiet, bro. Now, man, where are we at? The Resident Evil Mansion, bro? Are we attacked by a zombie? Should we go upstairs first? I guess so. I see someone right here. Locked door. Hello, worker. This is your first day of company. Watch your experience. What we will offer to the public once our vacation, retro vacation resort opens. The testing room is to teleport. And every time you have we have uh, have activity ready for you, it will appear in this room and form a floppy disk. You insert the disk into the player at the back of the room and start the activity. When you're finished, we'll ask you to fill out a survey. Ooh, all right. So here. Oh wait, did I pause the video? Okay, I did. But here, so here's the thing. Okay. And it goes on there. I do. All right, going in, guys. What is this? Do I just want cardboard, bro? Can't. No. 
Oh, there's achievements in the game. What do we got here? Finish the game, read every document, and then powered by CDs and digital explicit. Oh, okay, okay. It's not too many achievements. I guess it's gonna be like a somewhat short, short game. Nothing back there. So what do we got over here? How are you, sir? Employees only? Huh? Oh, I thought it opened. VIP room? Okay. Must be to go that way. Ah, okay. It's about this game, though. Is, is there like a monster in here? You know, what, 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 what's spooky about this game? You know, I, I, I wonder because I mean, eventually we're gonna we're gonna find it or whatever. But is something gonna like jump us? Is it just like a spooky atmosphere in the game? Is that is it, like the only thing? I don't know. That's a good question. I guess I need more documents so I can get that achievement for the hundred percent. Hmm, nothing else. Well, it is only. Hello? Oh, downstairs. What is this? Okay. Is this a room where they put all the cardboard cutouts? Huh? Whoa. A disc. Ah, this guy's. But some cursed is going on. Now what? I think the AI has some bugs, bro. I can't move my head. Wait, what? You can pay up CDs to upgrade your stamina. Press shift to sprint. Ah, oh, okay. I got a VIP card, guys. Now I go back. Gosh, dude. Um, yeah, that's about it. All right. Nothing too crazy going on here. Better than some like weird stuff. Why am I doing this by myself? Yeah, it's like I gotta explore this virtual world by myself, guys. Yeah, I ever see those like if you are videos where someone just like gets like full like socked in the face or because <laughs> they had the goggles on, you know. I don't know. All right, here we go. Whoa! Howdy, sir. Can uh, spooky be out right there, man? Oh, what's that down there? They got a bathroom in here. Just with some like random person, bro. Is this how you use the bathroom? You know? Wait, what? Did it just move? What the hell, dude? Yeah, it just moved over here. You guys saw it, right? You saw a shadow? Okay, that's a bit weird. Let's go this way, I guess. Shower room? There's something down there. Now oh, you're playing the spooky music. Whoa! What the hell? Oh boy, I can't run. <laughs> oh, it's getting closer. Oh my god! Oh! Oh! <laughs> we did it! Giant hand? I don't think this is part of the uh, experience, you know? It's like, what's going on, man? Yeah, what's going on, bro? We get, like, attacked by a giant hand? Alright. I mean, that was, <laughs> that was kind of expected, you know? Alright. Dang, what the hell, bro? We're playing... Yeah, what's going on, dude? What the hell, bro? Playing Silent Hill now or something? Yeah, what? <laughs> that is a long drop, though. This will just drop down like this and hopefully none of them break. Oh. What was that? What is that? You guys see that? Okay, I got something there. It seems locked. We got something over here. So we got two paths. So, so the stamina system is so bad, bro. 
Maybe if you get more discs, it'll get improved, but... Like, bro, what is this? Yeah, what the hell? I'm playing in Silent Hill now, bro, or something? I don't know, dude, we're like in the hospital. <laughs> A noise? Spooky corridor? Is there like an emergency release where you can just like pull the lever and uh, get out of here or something? It's like, why am I forced to go through this again? <laughs> Glitches in a vacation resort world. Uh huh. Employee. Critical issues have were moved, emerging around the virtual resort areas. Escape beyond previous occurrences is in terms. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna sneeze. Hang on. Oh, man. Uh, it's fear that glitches cause concern. The thought of cloud for minor glitches occur in virtual environments. The current situation demands immediate action due to severe disruptions. So if they distance are necessary to restore normal operations. Okay. Press escape to view map. Oh. So we're in here. Power thing? Okay. Is this how we get out of here? the game or something? How get out of the world? Oh, that too. Oh, it like opens up doors, closes them. So I got a puzzle to deal with. That's nice, I guess. All right. Huh? What's that? I have no idea, but I guess we'll keep go keep going. What that do? I have no idea, dude. I can barely run. Timer for something. Lights turned off. Why are, why are like some rooms that are lights turning off? Mm -hmm. Two paintings now. I guess we gotta get through one door. Okay. Oh, right, that's right. I took the one from. Wait, I might get back in. That's like <laughs> I just thought of that. That's yeah, close back there. Wait, what? Oh snap! All right. Uh, there's more stuff back here. Yeah, I like turn on the light for a second. There's somewhere I can put this pain here. And lock it? This is like the only way I can think of. I'm very confused by this uh, system here, guys. Because I have to be able to get that painting. But at the same time... Dude, I hate games like this. <laughs> so if I put... I put a painting here, right? That closes, or that opens. But if I take that painting right there, then that... If I take, oh my god, dude, this game. All right, so if I take, if I take that pain right there, that closes. If I take this one right here, this one closes. So what do we do? I, I, I'm very confused. According to this, there's like, what is this? Some triggers here? I think this is where we're at right here. So we're right here. I don't see one for right there, though. Is it on the outside or inside? I didn't see one on the inside. There's one right here. That one opens this door here. So if I'm able to do open the door right here by doing stuff here, then we should be good. I don't know. Oh yeah, there is right here. You put a thing there, and then you can get into here. But don't you need two to open the one door or something? If I if I uh oh no wait, you go back right. You go back, and then you go back around, put the thing, ah, I get it now. Something a bad guy happened to me here if the light turns off, though? That's the part I don't get. It's like, why is it like dark in here? I don't know. But yeah, basically you put the painting in here, then you go back, and then grab it, and then you come back in here, and then, yeah. <laughs> ah, I get it now. Decided to think about it for a little bit here, guys. 
All right, I'm back. I got the paintings, guys. Put that there. Take this, and that one goes over here, I think. Now we can get out of here. Oh. Oh. Ah, it's green now. All right. I'm going through. Made it out, guys. All right. Hopefully, it doesn't get worse from here. Outstanding work, esteemed team member. To continue with your vital contributions, please grab the next floppy disk. Okay, but what's down there then? I don't know, there's more stuff down there, but... I keep inserting stuff in here? To get to you on? What's next? for the thumbnail though, not gonna lie. <laughs> Dang, there's uh, something like serial killer in the, the one tunnel. Alright. Here we go guys, here we go, alright. Yeah, what? <laughs> okay, what do we got here? The tunnel of love, guys. Here we go. What's this? Press the button to play the ball game. And that's blocked off, and there's a light flashy over there. All right. Oh, I see. You gotta like hold the ball up and get through. It's just like one of those jump scare games. You guys know for back in the day, the spooky maze game. It gets like so tight, you gotta like look like this <laughs> or something like that. Gosh, this is a lot harder than it looks, guys. I already failed like five times. I've gone back into like the, uh, the 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 one area above us here, like a few times, but it just keeps falling because this thing is jiggling all over the place. It's like holy crap, dude! I have to be like super careful with this. All right, back up here once again. Do this very gently, guys. Calm and steady. All right, I'm already I'm already like way farther than before. <laughs> Can I do it though? For the grand prize, guys. Okay. Oh shit. Almost there. Hey, I did it. What I get? Oh, CD. All right, I can run some more. Okay, very good. I got more stamina, guys. So who's lurking in here? What is this? Oh, it's a Cupid thing. I don't know what that says. Ticket booth here. Map be uh, bugging out. But we do have a map now, which is pretty cool. Okay, so I'm looking over the map here. We have a few emergency exits and stuff like that. So is that a way for us to get out? I don't know. But, uh, remove from people from immediate danger, alert others, emergency services, blockade doors and contain him, evacuate the premises. Yes, yeah, I mean, there's someone in here, guys. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty evident by the uh, health kits, you know, all over the place. So what do we have to do to get out of here? Just go through the entire area or something? I don't know. But there's someone definitely in here, guys, with the, all the health kits and stuff like that just all about. I wonder who's lurking in here, though. That's a good question. He asked me. Employees only. It's locked. I think I have to go through the thing first. Yep, guys. There's someone in here. And he seems pretty uh, evil if he asked me. Oh, I got the pilot. Pilot it myself? I don't know. It's going by itself, I think. Okay. 
Sound off pretty calm here, guys. There ain't no one like jumping around trying to get us, you know. Hmm. I got a bit of party back here, guys. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, but yeah, who's lurking in here, dude? If there's like health kits all over the place, who's in here, bro? <laughs> What's that? Oh, rounding here or something? Okay, I guess we're not stopping there, but it's an exit. I couldn't stop. Ah, uh, wedding? Oh. It appears I've hit another boat. <laughs> uh, yep, alright. Looks like we're going through the wedding area here, guys. There is quiet back here. Oh, and spooky too. What is this? Oh, never mind. Pretty well lit in here. Is anyone hiding behind these things? Children hiding in the trees. Oh, there's a dead guy in here too. What the hell, bro? Dang, what happened to you, homie? <laughs> yeah, I wonder who's in here, guys. What is this? Chainsaw? Damn, bro. Looks like he got you, bro. Holy moly. Chopped him in half. Right, I get again? I can't remember. It's a key for something. Oh boy. Oh yeah, there's a door back here. Yeah, I wonder who's in here, guys. Well, if I have to run, dude, I don't have any stamina. This game gives you no stamina unless you find discs for some reason. Oh, this is the one area. Oh, that one guy's gone. I think that, that might be the guy the guys we saw. That one guy that was sitting here, I think that's our boy. He's going around uh, stabbing people. So if you get shanked here, you die IRL or something? I guess so. <laughs> Alright, man. Whatever, dude. Uh, yeah, there's a health kit here. This is what I mean. There's someone in here, guys. Oh, it's for a box. It's back to where I need to be. Just wanted to make sure. Hmm? What's that noise? So why did the AI make um some wacko in here, dude? That goes around stabbing people? I don't know. <laughs> huh? Oh, it's the door. The door's shaking, guys. Because the AI is self-awareness, but uh, nature, uh, self-awareness, nature, it decided to take the form of a, a white man with a white clothes and a bowler hat. Okay, it might be. It might have something to do with his old, with his old self. Also named my man. Uh, also, at this time, Project Man seems to be obedient compared to all of our previous attempts. Uh huh. Oh, was that ticket thing? I thought it was like a thing you roll or whatever. Computer? Something spooky going on down there. Let's not go down there first. Huh? Oh, it's taking pictures of me. What the hell, dude? Oh, so I'm another escape route, I guess. If we need it. Something's going on to Lost and Found, though. It's like a mannequin is not in here. I guess this might be the one. Whoa! My eyes, bro. You guys see this? I don't think that's like some Cry of Fear crap, dude. You guys remember Cry of Fear where there's that jump scare? Holy crap, bro. Turn that sh sh shit off, dude. Blinding me, bro. Left click take pictures. Bound left click. Oh, I see now. This is our flashlight? Okay. Excuse me, guys. I need to get out of the way. Oh. They're locking me in, guys. I can't get out. Oh no. 
So how am I supposed to get out of here, dude? Just like push him over all right here. Who's this? What the hell? Who's that, bro? Oh, is I wrapped in meters? I don't know. Cloak. I was doing some like cry of fear crap, dude. You know, from the intro of that game. Is that a key? That's a move when you look at him. Look at who? Oh, him right there? Oh, now I gotta do some SCP stuff, dude. God damn it. So, this is our man? Yep, it is. <laughs> Alright. So, how am I supposed to do anything if I got strapped this boy? What is this? That's a gate. I can't get through. Don't mind if I look at the map here. So, we got a key, guys, but I don't I don't know what it's for. There's a bunch of there's an employee door, right? They head back. What's this? What's the break room? They move? Where is he? I get the key. Oh, he's right there. Gosh, bro, I can't see shit. Dude, where's this god? Oh, it's right here. <laughs> Alright, whatever, man. I might just, like, close the door and he can't get through. Wouldn't that be, like, a better option? Can you close the door? Blockade it or something? Oh, it's coming. Yeah, it's coming, dude. Oh. Whoa. Paving the path to AI consciousness. In the significant field, milestone of the tell the next solutions. Finding a company at the forefront of AI research has been awarded a prestigious prize recognition of their groundbreaking achievements. The accolade not only celebrates their remarkable achievements in the AI domain, a Sophia's speculation about possibly creating world's, world's first AI consciousness. The distinguished award, uh, award presented by the AI Association highlights the company's relentless pursuit of excellence and development of state-art neural networks and machine learning algorithms. Tireless efforts have pushed the boundaries of AI technology, bringing us closer to the realization of sentient machines, a concept once delegated to the realm of science fiction. Ah, okay. Yeltsin resigns? Oh, dang, this is like... Premier Putin? Oh, dang, bro. So it's not like moving around anymore, I guess? I can actually look around? Yeah, it seems like it. Mm hmm. So what happens now? Do I just head back to that one area that was locked before? The gate be closed though. So I guess I gotta take the long way around, I guess. Alright. I mean, it's made out of like, what, some mannequin? Can't you just like, break its knee? It, it's it's legs or something, dude. You know, just kick it down or something. Would that be like the better option here? I don't know, man. Oh man, but dang, bro, this stamina system. Ah! Oh, okay. <laughs> huh? Oh shit! Whoa! Oh, you are spooky, bro. Oh shit! I can't get back, dude. I'm not stamina. Get up, bro! Whoa! Ah! All right. <laughs> what the hell do I have to do, dude? I have to back up. I have to get away from the sky, bro. With no stamina, bro, dude. Let's go in this room. Oh. Okay, we gotta wait. Uh oh! I can't see. He's getting through, guys. This goddamn game, bro. Alright, here. Where, 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 where? Right here, too. Oh, I think it. Oh, you guys see that? Whoa! <laughs> oh, time to go. Goodbye. Can't you just close it behind you? 
come on, man. This guy's like, just like failing so hard, bro. Like, guys, saw that right? He's he's actually making a hole. That's pretty cool. All right, I'm crawling through, guys. I made it through. Here we can like throw the camera at his face, and it'll it'll slow him down for like a few seconds. <laughs> I don't know. How do you guys feel about games that do this crap, though? They, um... Oh no, it's locked. That's not good. They do crap like this, where it's all like, they don't give you a flashlight, but they'll give you, like, a goddamn camera or something to take pictures with. Huh? Oh, shit. He's out there, guys. <gasps> oh my god, it's him! Ah, I got away. <laughs> All right, whatever, dude. Yeah, good thing I got that stamina boost. Cause if if it, dude, you're pretty much forced to play the game, then, right? Yeah, you're pretty much forced to play that one ball game, bro, just to get through. Also, what happens if I die here? Do I just go back to the beginning of all this crap? That's a good question. Then I go. <laughs> yeah, that's a good question, though. So, dang, homie came back from the dead, guys. The uh, guess with a chainsaw, I guess. All right. But dang, I can make some dang thumbnails though with these like screenshots, bro. You guys see this? The one where he like gets us. Oh, look at that one, dude. That's like excellent, bro. And then we take this one. This this where's that one? Oh no, I didn't get it. That one. There's one there. Oh, I gotta go back, but. Take a screenshot through the video clip, but make that be the background. That'd be like epic, bro. Dang, bro. Ain't gotta trip you down here. Oh, I died. <laughs> it's like, see, this is what I mean, guys. I don't get. Do you guys get games that do crap like this? I like to be able to see, you know. Just give me a goddamn flashlight. It a flashlight, fl flash, flashlight like every other game, you know. Nah, I gotta do stuff like this, dude. Or something right there. Alright, so where are we at now? Oh, I gotta do some like tightrope walking here. Dang, how much uh, film does this thing have, dude? I bet you just give like one platform here where it's like a goddamn hole, or I'm just, I'm just gonna fall through. What is it? There's something back here. There's a door here. What is that? The ball game again? And what's down here? It's so bright, bro. What is this? Uh, uh, oh boy. Alright, I see how it's gonna be. Yeah, I can just do this, because the ball is just like... Yeah, it's just like a hole or whatever. What? What's going on? Okay, there we go. What if you had to do this? What well, that one guy with the chainsaw is like chasing you around. It gives you like it's like your his chainsaw runs out of gas or something, and you gotta like play this ball game. <laughs> yeah, you gotta play the ball game just to get out of the room he's in. Yeah, that'd be I don't know, dude. Definitely would would be a uh, pretty tense, you know, dude. Oh, hey god, I almost got it. Imagine I fail here. Okay. No, don't fall. I will not let you fall. We're so close, but I'm not gonna give up right now. What time is it? Okay. Oh, ho, ho. I made it. What I win? Oh, another stamina thing. Very cool. What's down there? That was so bright. Is that the AI consciousness? Oh, I can go down here. Yeah, I gotta go this way. What am I gonna do if this guy shows up, though? Just climb up or something, I guess? Oh boy, guys. What's going on now? Bit of uh, rumbling in the background. But I can't see crap. Go that way. 
Not this way. this come on man <laughs> all right off the ladder guys oh wait we're back here but um like further down or something i think yeah i guess we're pretty much yeah i i, I guess you're pretty much or if you get through this area and you just skip the stamina thing i don't know but Maybe it's maybe it'll get harder for you for like I don't know, but I guess just could be like a final boss fight or something, dude. This is my assumption here. So what are you get? It's like what are you gonna do if 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 you're like that person who just like skips everything though? I don't know. And you guys see the stamina? It doesn't like regenerate very fast. It's very slow. So I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna. I don't know, dude. It's like what are we gonna do if we have to like do another run sequence? Where am I at now? What? Oh, what the hell? I'm back here again. Oh, we're at the front entrance. All right. Well, I had a good experience here, I guess. I might have had like my neck sliced once by that guy, but Ouch, <laughs> whatever. Next one. Well, before we do that, guys, what is down here? I'm just like, I'm, I'm just curious. Before we keep, because we're still in the same area, but I haven't explored this yet. It's a door back here. Interesting. You guys see how long it takes to stand up to regen, though? Absolutely insane, dude. It takes so long. You guys see this? It's like, I don't know, I've seen games do, do it a whole lot faster. We just have to walk like this so much. There's a door in an elevator. Interesting. Oh yeah, I can unlock it? Wait, what? I can unlock it. I guess we're going downstairs, alright. But yeah, I can just go down here. Okay. This place. Neuralnet Solutions would like to remind you not to forget to report any encountered issues for ongoing enhancements in our virtual paradise. Your feedback is essential in shaping the future of our immersive experiences. Keep up the great work. Computer. Tools. I'm saying many times to. What's that noise? Over there. Wait, what? Huh? Perm open now. So it's like I had a choice of but doing that one things, or just going down to this dark, spooky basement. <laughs> All right. Where am I at now? Corridor? Do I hate this crap so much? Where's the goddamn flash light switch? Mm hmm. Oh, what's this? Thumbs up with this. Okay. Another toilet. Very weird. Uh, all right, but hold on, boy, dude. I hate this crap so much. Can I get upgraded to a flashlight. Do this game better upgrade me to a flashlight, like later on, because this crap is so bad, dude. Yeah, stop glitching out in here. Is this where the employees go or something? Internet solutions. Huh? 
Oh, what the fuck? Dang, homie. There's a guy hanging there, alright. How's it hanging, you know? <laughs> alright. Uh, let me just call the elevator, maybe I'll dislodge him a little bit. I don't know, I have no idea, dude. What's down here? Interrogation room, man, what the hell, dude? There's a note here. Confidential. A subject enhanced experience glitches and lost. Uh, uh, subject experience glitches or lost contact with outside world. If you experience any issues, then glitches. Someone is attempting to harm you, and or can't leave the simulator. First off, floppy disk says facility looking behind a door to the following code. Okay. If you access the back end, you are using the spell language. We're here to be able to find a button to turn off the simulation exit safely. Uh, you might experience severe glitches during this procedure. Thank you for your feedback. First off, floppy disk is facility behind a door with the following code. I don't know what the code is. It's kind of like it's like. And, you know, just sharpied out, dude. I see it, though. S someone attempted to harm you and or cannot leave the simulation. I gotta find a floppy disk out of here safely. Okay, that's good to know, I guess. Homie here kind of got his uh, head caved in. Alright. What if he just, like, I don't know, got, like, a crowbar or whatever. What if he just overwhelmed the AI? You just, like, I guess, I don't know, maybe the AI is not, uh, you know, um, smart enough to be throwing out, uh, what's it called? Multiple, you know, enemies here. I feel just overwhelm it with, like, you just release, release this stuff to the public and then let everyone else be, like, the sacrificial land. <laughs> I have no idea. Wait, here, wait, what? Oh. Let's just head back, I guess. Alright, back out here. Use it on this. What's back here? Now open that up. Let Casper here do everything. What is this? It's just that massive pit. Do I do go down it? Huh? Hey, what? Okay, I'll stay in there, I guess. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Another corridor. Oh, we're under our side, I think. Oh, no, wait. What is that? Is that the floppy disk that we need? Is that the special? Oh, that might be it, guys. That might be it. That might be how we get out of here. I think. Maybe it's like multiple endings, right? The one ending is like you do everything. And the other ending is like... You, um... Oh, what's it called? Yeah, the other ending is just like you just get out of here or something. I don't know. Is this a door with a code that we need? It is. How, how many digits? A four digit code. One, two, th three, four. One, 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 one. Gotta do the common things here, guys. None of them worked. What's that say on there? Oh, it, has, it has like the you know, numbers that you put before. So we found a door. We need a code. I guess we have to keep doing the, 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 the one thing. So maybe it'll give us a code to get out of here. They'll be all like, all right, thank you for participating in this thing. I can get out of here or something like that. I guess that's what what it means or something. There's something in here, though. I don't like you, man. A bit too spooky for me. Okay, that closes off. Or it opens, I mean. What? There we go. So I guess I'll like look around here. Holy moly. That's going back up. What's over here? Staircase? But yeah, I'm enjoying the game so far. Definitely well designed and stuff like that. But holy moly, dude, this stamina system and this camera crap, dude. There's always these things, the an these uh, not anime games, but indie games. I always do like something to make the game like horrible, dude. And this is and, and this game does has like these two things, you know, where you're just like, I don't know. It's like the indie game is good, but um, yeah, the indie game is good, but uh, it just does crap like you know, goddamn, like this this stuff here. So what's next? <laughs> There's always something about these indie games to make it like, I don't know, a chore to play, you know? So what's gonna be on today? Come with us. 
Uh -huh. A secluded stroll through one of nature's finest. Follow the tracks. Us. One of nature's best kept secrets. Oh yeah, just I'm getting Come chased by kidnappers or something, dude. I don't know. Come with us. Let's go visit him, I guess. I'll go visit the guy in there, guys. The train tracks or something. Alright. Oh, nice so far. But man, I'm hungry, dude. What happens if you quit the game? I'm just curious, because I, I, I want to get like a bite to eat here. What happens if you just quit? And you click continue. I just want to make sure. I don't have to do everything like all over again, you know? Where am I? Oh shit, wait, what? Where are we, dude? <laughs> Did I forget to save? Do I have to do everything all over again? Oh god. Wait, what? Oh fuck. Alright, uh. <laughs> There's no checkpoints in the game? Wait, what is this one? Uh. I forgot, I forgot about the end. Yeah, it is. Okay, god damn it. Dude, I, I, I completely forgot about the save thing down there. God damn it. This game doesn't have checkpoints? Are you joking, dude? Oh my god. Wait, load game. Oh, fuck. Hell no. Oh, right, whatever. <laughs> yeah, that's not good, guys. Um, Dude, it's all, all, all because I got hungry, dude. There's no checkpoints in the game. God damn it. Alright, uh, I'll come back. Hang on. Uh, let me deal with this. Alright guys, I'm finally back. I had to do everything all over again. That was so cancerous, dude. <laughs> but alright, we're back here. The, the only thing... I did, I did the levels before this, but I didn't do the... Um, I didn't go back down into the basement again. I guess we'll do that whenever we find what the code is, I guess. Well, let's see what this place is like, I suppose. Gosh, bro, that was, that was so bad, dude. I had to do everything all over again. It didn't help that I had, like... You know, the slowest goddamn stamina out there, too. Whoa! Dang, who's that? So, we got someone out here. Yeah, I had to slow it. I mean, this is the thing. You guys see it? Like, like, I keep mentioning this, but the stamina, bro, it's just like. I had to do, the into, I had to do everything with this the stamina that I have, bro. So, what we got down here? Tunnel? Oh, it's blocked off. Now do I, whatever should I do? Oh, go down here, okay. You know, at least in Cry of Fear, or whatever, you only had to deal with this camera crap in the beginning of the game. And the devs had enough sense to, you know, not make it, you know, not, not make it, like, you know, the main flashlight of the game, but in this game, it's just all like, no, you get no flashlight at all, you gotta, you gotta use this thing the entire game <laughs> to be able to see. It's like, come on, bro. Uh, and then you end up bumping into stuff that you can't see because it's so goddamn dark. So I want, when am I gonna get that code though? That's another thing. The map over there. This water. A tunnel over there. So what's the map say? Dang, massive area. All right, here we go. It goes off to the left. Been crazy going on as of right now. Oh, and it appears I went the wrong way. It's this is why I mean, man. Come on, bro. I gotta walk all the way back using this goddamn thing because I can't see like what's ahead of me. All right, what's back here? the way out, or is this like this de another dead end? Oh wait, yeah there's a way over here. 
Oh, claustrophobia, guys. Tight corners. What's that? Water behind me? Oh, that's kind of weird, bro. Homie's behind me, bro. The mannequins again. Now I got another choice of where to go. This is a sewer area. Wait, how much do I have of the game after this? Because I know there's, there's not there's not many achievements for the game, so it's not gonna be like a multi-part series. But it's like, yeah, how much more of the game is left after this, though? Am I gonna get the code after this? Get out of the thing safely? Oh, we're on the train tracks now. The question is, which way though? Maybe towards the red light? Yeah, towards the red light. See, this is what I mean, dude. I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have this. I, I could just easily just glance over to the left and be like, okay, it's just a dead end back there. I could have just, you know, instead of just, you know, doing this this crap right here, it's like, come on, we're. <laughs> is there anything secret back here, though? Oh, I thought I saw something back here, but I guess not. Yeah, and then we gotta walk all the way back. I can't even, like, jog. That's another thing, too, that I don't like about these games, dude. It's like, you know, I play games every now and then. There's like this game out. There's like these games out there that make the stamina system like so unrealistic. Like this one, it's like this guy can only run like a few feet, bro, before like giving up. I have to find another one of those like ball machines or whatever, just to be able to get a CD just to get more stamina. Okay. Men, women. Oh, guys, at least we have a lot of bathrooms in this game, am I right? The hell is down there? See, this is what I mean. I I, I want to be able to look inside the toilet seat, but I can't. Because, goddamn, I have to, like... Ugh. Uh, dude. Alright, what's in the women's bathroom? Anything cool in here? Toilet. Toilet. Has a graffiti on it. I thought it was like a snow for a key or something. Our toilet. Huh? Someone's in there. Now it's locked for some reason. I don't know why. Do I have to like walk back there though? Yeah, that's another thing too. If I have to walk back there, guys, I don't know. Maybe it's just they've decided to just make one. You know, one of them locked. But that's another thing too. I just thought about that. You know, before we had, because there's no uh, checkpoints in the game. But if you get killed by something, there is a checkpoint for that. So I don't get why the dev couldn't make yeah check like an actual like a save checkpoint. You know, because I wouldn't have to do all this again if I didn't. Accidentally quit there, dude. It's just, it's just like, bro, what? So there's a checkpoint for if you get killed, but if you want, if about well, a checkpoint for a save, nah, bro. The dev won't do that. <laughs> Dartboard. Yeah, we're looking for another one of those machines too, just to be able to at least gain more stamina. But then again, it's like. It goes up so slow. Man, what the hell, dude? Alright. Maybe in there being, like, I don't know, blended or something. A bed? More locked doors? I don't know, do you guys consider this fun? This the good old camera over and over again. Man, this game is such a walking sim though, dude. Holy moly. What is this? As soon as the bridge keeps bugging out and every time we try to fix it, it breaks itself again. If you're trying to cross the bridge, turn off the power first or get electrocuted. Doing that also turns off the lights, so good luck with that. Okay. We got the key, guys. So I need to cross the bridge. 
because for some reason they made this one like, I don't know, closed off or something. That's another thing too. Back when we um did the uh, one thing where, the where we got the camera, it's like, uh, how do I say this? There's like a rapid fire mode. Would that make things for tolerable guys if we had like a rapid fire mode on the camera? It's like, why can't, why can't the, oh, what, oh, this one just, this just went around. Where was that one door again? Oh, yeah, it was back here. But it's like, why can't we get the rapid fire mode? But for some reason, the mannequin can. I don't know. Where am I going again? I can't remember. Oh, this is where we came in from, right? Oh, wait, I don't know. Isn't this a door, too? Just we have to track the power or something? Oh, it's not a door. Dude, I'm so confused. Is that for this door? Oh, it is. Alright. Now the lights are off. Oh, great. Now I can't see, bro. Jesus Christ, dude. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> It is literally pitch black in here. You guys understand this crap? God damn it. Wait, wasn't this back there? Like the way, the way back. Dude, I don't even know where I'm going. Oh yeah, it is back here, but it's like blocked off or something. That means I have to go the long way. Alright. Gosh, bro. I just want to make sure there's nothing in here. Wait, is this the right way? Dang, who's down here, guys? Oh, I hear breathing. Oh. <laughs> oh, I got him. I got him. I got a screenshot of him. Dang, is that the AI manifested? I guess so. Light bulb. Elevator. Alright. Alright, it's falling apart. Oh! Alright, we're here. Oh, sh oh, I almost fell down there. <laughs> oh, it's down there anyway. I guess that's where we go next. Whatever you say. Oh. Be here, guys. What do I get? Oh, the camera. Sacrificing the camera? Oh, yep. No more camera anymore, guys. Alright. Is this the part where you get the flashlight? Maybe a torch? You know, like Minecraft or something? I guess we go this way? Okay, I guess we went somewhere. Now we're here. Dang, who's that, bro? What the hell, man? Got a party going on in here or something, dude. Got some bozos here, you know, they got like their, um, what's it called? What is that, phone? I don't know. Can't go that way. Lever. What the hell is that? Got some knives. Alright. Oh. Now opens up a passage right there. We have two more over here. I guess we go this way. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought it was like closing up again. Is this room with a note? 
I will be reborn once more a new vessel. It seems like there is a complete dictant of communication shells within the organization. I find myself unable to leave the ongoing simulation. Something's trying to trap me inside of it. Can't reach anyone. Uh, maybe that's the one guy we saw, guys. With the multiple eyes. The AI is trying to get out into reality or something. Hmm. Interesting. Which way now? I guess we'll go this way. Oh, that's back to over there. I don't know what that did. Oh. I can use the knives to stab these guys. But it says I only have two knives left. So what happens if I use them on all of them, though? I'll be able to get to see what's in this room. Oh, never mind. I thought my lives were going down, but apparently I can just reuse them. I just randomly stab someone, alright. <laughs> so what's back here? More rooms? Nice area to squeeze through over there. Yeah, bro, this stamina system is absolutely atrocious, bro. I I'm a real here. It's this is absolutely horrible. Can I, can I get one of those ball games? You have like what, three more? A phone call? Well, I just stabbed someone, so I don't know. Maybe that's how you send the one guys, I guess. Yeah, like get near them and then whoever's like beating or whatever or emits a signal, we just stab them, bro. I already randomly stabbed someone. <laughs> so I don't know. Alright, we're back here. Alright guys, huh? Oh yeah, a signal. Can I take my knife back? I can. Alright. Yeah, I thought, thought maybe a chainsaw guy's coming back. Well, I think it wants me to get get the knives back, dude. It's like <laughs> makes things even more worse. Hello. I don't know. Didn't do anything. Ringing the doorbell. No one came. So what's going on now, peeps? I thought something maybe changed there, but I guess not. So, is that a door open now? I can get out of there, out of here or something. Just had like one spooky encounter with like I guess the AI or something, but yeah, I don't know. I think it's there. No, it's not. It's still not there. Oh great! I have to figure out the chime. Tell me I have to go back and forth to figure out the chime here. <laughs> oh my god, dude, this is so bad. I mean, it wouldn't be too bad if he had stamina, but dude, this game is like absolutely, it's, it's, it's getting worse. <sighs> Did I get it? Oh, yeah, it's just, it's just like this. You go done, done, done. Okay, it wasn't as hard as I thought it was. There you go, boom. Boom boom, okay. <laughs> Dude, this game is so, I don't know. Outstanding work, team team ever to continue with your vital contribution. Please call up the next floppy Floppy disk. Subject, man take over. If man try and kill you or simulation is coming around you, fear not. Because of its civil awareness, your man I realize he's trapped in simulation. If this is the case, there's a secret tunnel behind the pin, uh, pin up doll in the basement of the house in simulation. And behind me, you should be able to find a special property disc to leave the simulation reset to original state. Uh, but the thing is. I don't know, should we just go do that, guys? I don't know, maybe like a little finale for the video here. I know there's like a little bit more to the game still left. 
You know, let me act, make sure to actually save this time. And now I gotta do everything at the downstairs all over again. Oh. Access denied. Okay, that's nice. I guess I can't leave then. Yeah, I don't know if I. I, 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 I okay, now I gotta go this way. Yeah, I don't know, dude. I kind of feel like I want to give up on the game, to be honest, with all this, like, stamina crap. But at the same time, I still want to see the ending, so I don't know. This way. Okay. That way. Okay. This way again. Forward. Oh, got out. Okay. And now it's gone. But what do you got back here? Five, seven, four, nine. Oh, it's the code. Thank you very much. So we got the code, guys, to get out of here. Bro, I'm like dying, bro. The stamina, dude. It wouldn't be so bad if I could actually run, but holy moly, bro. And one video I saw early, one video I saw to um, what's it called? How do I how do I say this? To progress the game, man. By the time he was in that, is this still a size is denied? Hey, what? Oh, I opened it. <laughs> but in the one video I saw, basically the level he was on, he had like or he was usually on the fourth stamina bar, but 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 uh. Where I am, uh, what's a, I don't, I don't know how to, I don't know how I say this. But by the time, but you know, I, I haven't found out where the fourth thing is. So I don't know, but I guess I'll end it here, guys. And the next video, we'll finish it up. But other than that, I guess that's pretty much the video for for now. I'll see you guys next one. Subscribe for more. And yeah, it's time for me to go. All right, uh, bye. <laughs> yeah, I need a break, bro. This game is like, I don't know, I, I don't know if I'll finish it. I have no, I guess we'll see. But other than that, guys, uh, see ya.